Greetings. Recently, Triforce games have been added in the list of free and playable titles for TechnoParrot emulator. In this video, we'll install and test Mario Kart GP Arcade. Before we continue, you need the necessary files needed for this not so short tutorial. And please don't ask me where to get the game files. Just be a little creative on your search on the internet. It's going to be your lucky day. Okay, if you're ready, let's get started. Let's boot TechnoParrot. At the main list, scroll down for Mario Kart GP. You can press letter M on the keyboard to immediately jump to the first title that start with the letter M. Make sure you have an updated list. To do that, click on the three dash line on the upper left most corner. Click check for updates or install updates if it is available. After you're done updating, click again the three dash line and click add game. Scroll down from Mario Kart GP, then choose add game. Now that the game is available for configurations, click on game settings. Take a brief moment to look at the top left corner of the screen. At the end of the word, game executable, you will find the correct version of the game that you will need. Make sure you have the correct one. Then redirect the game executable by clicking just above the gray line. A pop-up window will show up immediately. Now, if your file is the right version but different file name, it will not show up in selection inside the folder. So what to do? By this time, it's still too early to panic. You may suggest renaming the file, but there is another way. On the bottom right corner, just click on the drop down list, then choose all files. This way, all available files inside that folder will be all visible. Now you can choose the ISO file that you need regardless of its file name. Then go to your game directory, then choose the file needed. In this case, it's Mario Kart Arcade GP ISO. Next, configure general input API, whether X input or direct input, depending on what you're using. In this demonstration, we will use an Xbox 360 controller, so we choose X input. On general window, it is up to you, but we recommend full screen, so we leave this untick. Then change the wheel sensitivity to your liking. Feel free to experiment. Then hit save if you're fine with the settings. You can go back and adjust later. Then let's configure the control button assignment. I'm using an Xbox controller. So depending on what you use, you can freely manage the button's assignments to your perspective. Don't forget to save before exiting. Let's try to boot the game. If this is your first time booting the game and have not done any configuration yet, then we recommend being focused and look closely. On boot, it will be on device check. So depending on your machine, it will take time on some occasion. We may have to speed up the playback, so you won't get bored on waiting just in case. The camera check usually takes long, so be patient. After a while, the camera error will pop up. Don't worry about it. Just wait for a message to push the cancel button to appear. Push the cancel button, otherwise you'll be stuck there. After that, another link checking will take place. Just wait it out until it displays a Nintendo logo, then press the test button. You will be prompted with another set of menus. Now, go to the Enter Game Test for Mario Kart. Use the Service button to maneuver to the menu, then enter with Test button again. Now that you're in the Test menu, just wait a little longer and don't do anything until the highlighted items start blinking. When it started blinking, go to the Game Options. Once there, turn off the steering power and the camera, then exit using Test button. After that, head to the I.O. Test menu, then go to initialize. Just use your controller button assignments from earlier to test all. Then hit the test button again to go to the next test menu. Push the test button while holding the service button to exit. Then push the test button again to exit the menu. That's it. It will automatically restart the game and you can now begin playing. If you made it here this part of the video, thank you for watching. And if this video is helpful, might as well like and subscribe. Very appreciated. But before you go, we'll leave you a short game. Have a great day.
Mario! What? <laughs> 